EU leaders regularly make tedious speeches about peace, how valuable peace is, how thankful we have to be to the European Union and its founding fathers, and so on. But despite countless speeches about peace, they're pushing a project that threatens to propagate war. Its name is PESCO. PESCO is short for Permanent Structured Cooperation and was activated in 2017. It is the basis to create a European Defence Union. PESCO is a programme that obliges Member States to constantly increase their military expenditure and advance military cooperation. Further moves down this track followed, like the Defence Programme EDIDP, Military Mobility and now the Defence Fund, which means billions in public money for militarization projects and war equipment. Thierry Breton, EU Commissioner for Industry, and Josef Borrell, EU High Representative for Foreign Affairs and Security Policy, declared, Europe must become more self-confident, also in defence policy. However, during a social and economic crisis, it makes no sense to provide over 25 billion euros for armaments and the military under the EU's long-term budget. Projects like the Defence Fund also violate Article 41.2 of the EU Treaty, according to which EU budget may not be used for military measures. Thus, the proposal is not only politically dangerous, it's illegal. Plus, the billions wasted on killer weapons could be better put to use in hospitals, schools and public transport, or for useful medical and environmental research in Europe and around the world. If you're really concerned about peace, there is a way you can truly contribute to safeguard it. Contact your political representatives and let them know you want to stop the militarization of the EU. Send them mail, tag them on social media and let them know you're against a militarized EU which will increase the danger of war. European history has shown what armament, war and militarization mean. Real security can only be achieved with disarmament and through peace. The only war worth fighting is the one against war itself. Let's build peace together.